Use the automated pre-trip walk-around feature to check your exterior lights. To initiate, turn the ignition key to aux or accessory. Then hold down the work light for five seconds. The light indicators on the dash will begin to flash. With this Diamond Logic feature, you can check all the lights, except the backup lights, on both the cab and the trailer. Remember, a burned out bulb can cost you up to six points on your CSA score and affect your company's federal safety record. Ultra low sulfur diesel fuel is required for all on highway diesel engines using advanced after treatment systems. For complete details on fuel requirements, see the engine operation and maintenance manual supplied with the vehicle. To determine acceptable biodiesel and biodiesel blends, refer to the engine operator and maintenance manual for the applicable engine. Max Force engines should not use biodiesel blends higher than 20%. If your truck has an SCR equipped engine, you will need to monitor the level of diesel exhaust fluid, DEF, in the additional tank. Make sure to use API approved DEF. DEF is a reducing agent used in the after treatment exhaust to reduce the NOx produced by the engine. DEF is a liquid solution comprised of 33% urea and 67% purified water. The system will inject the DEF into the exhaust stream and use approximately 2-3% DEF by volume as diesel fuel. So a truck that uses 15,000 gallons of diesel fuel per year would use approximately 375 gallons of DEF. Moisture taken in with the air through the compressor inlet valves collect in the reservoirs and necessitates draining each reservoir periodically. This is done by opening the drain cocks located at the end of all tanks. If the drain cock is opened in the end of the tank, there must be some air pressure in the system to assure proper drainage. Be sure to close the drain cocks after all moisture has been expelled. On the vehicle so equipped, the reservoir automatic drain valves ejects moisture and contaminants from the reservoir in which it is connected. It operates automatically and requires no manual assistance or control lines from other sources. The reservoir should be drained and the valves should be examined periodically to ensure that drain passage is not obstructed. 